today we find out which one is better. I have two chicken thighs here. The one on your left, my left, is going to be Cajun two-step. I'm going to smother it. Both sides. I already used this method with the Creole seasoning. Uh, the Tony Satchery's Creole seasoning. Do this. Put it in the air fryer. And keep it on the left side. Start up top. Now we'll do the Tony Satchery's. I've trimmed both of these uh, thighs. I'm not taking a measurement of how much I'm putting on either one because I just know my eyeball seasoning. I'm going to put this one on the right. You can see a little bit of a color difference in the two-step and the Creole. The Creole is a lighter, a lighter color. The two-step looks like it has more other seasonings other than salt. The Tony Satchery's has twice the sodium as the Cajun two-step. So I'm gonna do, I'm gonna do uh, two of each. Cause the air fryer can hold four. So I'm gonna take my chicken thigh. Got some extra skin right here. Take that off. Okay. Some extra, extra stuff going on right there. Extra right there. Again, left side, Cajun two step. And all this is subjective, obviously. Some people are going to like one more than the other. Everybody's going to have a different opinion, you know. I tell you, I like this. I've only had this two-step once. I put it on some uh, pork, some shredded pork I had a couple days ago. I could tell right away it was not as salty, but it had a more of a savory flavor to me. Alright, so <clears throat> you look. Let me see. I don't know what you. This is the two step. Look at how much red and more color it has. This is the Saturys. Now, I promise you, that Saturys one is completely saturated with seasoning. It's just the different, different seasonings in there. That's got it. Thrown off. Alright, so sticking with our left to right, put this guy on the left, and this guy 
on the right. I'm kind of touching right now, but that was strength. I have a Oster air fryer. So I'll do this. And I will go to my chicken setting and I'll go with it. And we'll see what they look like when they come out. I'll give it a taste test. It's got to cool off for a long time. So uh, 25 minutes from now, we'll take them out and see what we got. Alright. Chicken thighs are done. First view of them. Let's see here. Set this. I'm gonna show you how something ready for this. Some crispy skin. Two step out first. Two step seasoning burned more than the uh, Creole. There's the Creole and there's the two step. Something in the something in the two step burns. Maybe some. Pepper, garlic, onions, which, I don't know, that, that Tony Satchery is right there. Looks a little bit dark. Uh, backside looks great. Uh, oh, yeah. So, anywho, these things are like hot pockets, they take a long time cool down put this back I got a few more in the fridge I have made up I'm gonna uh, make those as well all right so we have our chicken thighs I have two step on the Creole <coughs> Let me start off by saying, I know I like the Tony Satchery's Creole. I, I like it. <clears throat> uh, I got me a little cup of water here, palate cleanser. So I'm gonna start off with the Tony Satchery's, I think, because I know what it tastes like. It'll give me a good baseline. Bone in, skin on thigh. Delicious, as expected. I feel like you can overdo it with Satchery's. I'm almost to that level on that chicken thigh. Juice squirting out of that thing. Look at that thing. Ooh. Air fryer is great for chicken thighs. Not so much anything else chicken, probably. Maybe some chicken wings. Oh, palate cleanser. And I don't need to lick my fingers yet. Tony Satchery's Creole seasoning, delicious. Two step. Chicken thigh. Very much more subtle. Mm. 
much more subtle flavor. Stuck to the skin. Look at her skin. Skin with a piece of meat. So not near as salty, like I said. Go back to the saturies again. Okay, <clears throat> so I find myself in quite a predicament. The saturies is almost overwhelming. The two-step is kind of underwhelming. It tastes great on the skin. It has some more ingredients that burn. Hmm. Excuse me. Wow, I know I'm gonna eat two chicken thighs trying to decide here. It's crazy, I'm gonna eat the complete thing. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and call it. I like the Satries better still. I, I like the two-step and you can always add more two-step, you know, after the product is cooked. I see now why, you know, in the Stealth Cracker video, he, he puts a lot on there, you know. I see why. <clears throat> it's a good, it's a good flavor. But, you, but I, I, I did not add enough. Uh, one second. Fix this. Down right here. Some more of that two step. That's better. You know, now that I put this on chicken, I wonder if it says on hints of that Old Bay seasoning. Tastes like the Old Bay sunflower seeds seasoning. I mean, I know Old Bay is a seasoning, but it reminds me of Old Bay. I like it. I like them both. For me, <clears throat> the Satries, Tony Satries Creole, more my more my speed. I like to thank my friend Sean Yarbrough. He bought me this. Well, he bought he bought some. And gave me this one. So thank you, Sean, for that. If you ever watch this. <clears throat> uh, I like it. I do like it. Um, I'm going to. I'm going to use it a lot. Um, 
For me, the Satries is more my flavor profile. Though, so, again, everybody's gonna have their own opinion. Everything, everybody's gonna have a different opinion. I feel like this would be great on those crawfish and stuff that he's cooking. The fish. Shrimp. I, yeah, shrimp. I feel like fish, shrimp, and crawfish. I can, this would be excellent. This probably would take the cake <clears throat> on seafood over the Tony Satries. Um, wow. Anyway, that, that's my, that is my verdict. Thank you for watching. Uh, try it out yourself. Um, Stell Cracker, you got a biography on there. Little small, short autobiography. Um, yeah, I, it's good. But on chicken, chicken thighs in particular, Tony Satry is, is a, just, it's a step up. And like I said, you can always put more of this on, but I feel like the saturies penetrated further than just the skin. And um, overall just fit more fit my flavor profile. Have a good day. Thank you.